Good evening guys. Welcome to Arkel's Home Cooking. This evening, I'm going to show you how to make a teriyaki duck. It's completely made with scratch. And I'm making a homemade teriyaki sauce. Go with this duck. Duck meat is one of the really good pairing with the sweet and scented flavor. Historians say teriyaki was invented by Japanese chef in 1700. We leave the history here and start to cook teriyaki duck. Few ingredients are on the table here. Four pieces of fresh duck breast, one orange, two spring onions, one and a half teaspoon honey, three tablespoon demerara sugar, Japanese sweet wine, mirin, or you can use a Japanese sake, kikoman soya sauce, it's actually naturally brewed soya sauce. It's the best to use for teriyaki, especially Japanese cooking. Let's start to make a teriyaki duck. Start to score the duck breast. It's better to be score the skin side. Score the skin, not very deep, just small score like that. Too deep. It's going to be a difficult, they will become apart. Duck is beautiful when it's go to the teriyaki sauce. That's done. Duck breast is no deeply, you can see a, a mini pocket, just touching the skin only. Because no need to go very deep. The reason they're becoming apart, that's the reason saying you don't go too deep. Duck you can eat undercooked because duck is a red meat medium rare heavy skillet or cast iron pan is the best to make um, teriyaki to seal the the duck medium heat is better not very hot the duck breast skin side down You can see the fats are weeping out and it will be puddled with the fat. See that's a duck fat. Duck on up the meat you have to cook really gently. So it's if you overcook, duck is taste is different. It's because more iron in the meat. You see the amount of the fat come from the, the duck skin. And once they, they're bubbling up the fat, you gently flip, no tearing the skin. Wow. That is nice. The smell. Beautiful. The duck is cooking their own fat. Duck is very fine to eat medium rare, normally pink in there. So again, I said to you earlier, it's a red meat. Gently moving the heat a little bit higher, not much. This duck is becoming a little bit mad now because of the water and fat together. I turn all the corners gently seal to make it brownish color. But again, very gentle. Maybe Hold on. Still alive, I think. These ducks are cooked rare. So I have to make it medium rare on my next uh, cooking step. So I'm taking it out from the fat. Thank you. 
that fat, I'm going to remove it. Same. Good amount of that fat. See. It can use for roasting or anything. I normally get rid of it. Pan back to the fire. Still very little amount of fat is there. The pan is again medium hot. Mirin. 50 milli shot glass. That is 50 going there. Hundred. Let's have a little bit of alcohol. Sugar. Going there. Honey. It's a very limited honey. It's giving the really nice, thick and beautiful sweet flavor to the honey. That's the reason. It's optional. Some people don't use honey, sugar only. You can use a dark brown sugar, but getting again very dark color because the soya bring dark. And also maybe you notice this cooking have no salt. The soya have their own salt. So the soya sauce is giving the salt for this duck and the sugar giving the sweetener. 50 ml soya. Very simple. It is amazing. When it's starting to bubble, it's, you can't put too fiery because it's a rotation. Teddy means sugar glazing. Yaki means grilling or boiling in Japanese language. Teddy yaki. Two words together, teddy yaki. Evaporating and reduction of the soya and mirin. Mirin is actually a rice wine. It's a high sugar content and very low alcoholic content. The taste is fantastic. And the mirin is, you can see they're starting to reduce. That means it's getting thicker. Orange. Just squeeze. Avoid the bits, because bits can make it a bittery taste when it's cooking. That's the reason I'm avoiding. Teriyaki sauce normally don't go orange. The reason I'm adding the orange for the duck. I try to taste a little bit of the sauce. So it's really hot. Oh my God. That is um, orangey. Difficult to explain. It's something beautiful scented flavor in your mouth. Thank you to the Japanese people who invented this food. Arigato gozaimasu. That's what they say in Japanese language. So let's start to put the duck. The skin on the top, the meat, visible side of the pan. Beautiful. I gently turning down the duck. You can see nice and beautifully brown here. The key idea is going to the teriyaki sauce and the sweet and orangey flavor inside the duck. That's the reason. And heat a little bit higher. Taking out the duck because I said to you earlier it's a medium rare cooking or a little bit over than medium rare. Wow, the flavor packed inside and outside the duck breast. Thinly slice the spring onion. Hold the spring onion. I sliced in there. Just leave this to the don't have to cook too long because it disappeared the spring onion color. Now the time to turn off the sauce. You can see the reduction and how thick. And I show you the thickness. See. That is the consistency. Teriyaki sauce is coming to the Trivex. It's a very heavy pan. The sauce first the color you see just gently move it nicely slice the duck duck is a bit hard meat I 
and nicely rest them. The next one. really can't wait to taste this teriyaki duck duck is still medium rare you can't cook overcook the duck because it's getting really tough time to plate up my duck let's go here one wow sweet Garnish the duck. So here are some spring onion. I made it like a spring shape. When you put in the water, they're becoming springy. Japanese teriyaki duck. Japanese normally eat teriyaki with the steamed rice. They call gohan. Japanese, most of the food they eat with rice. Teriyaki, you can eat with its own or with rice. Us. A main course or starter. I can't wait. Wow. Mmm, that's really, really nice. Mmm, so succulent, so tasty. Unbelievable taste. Thank you for watching Marquez Home Cooking. I see you next time with the different videos. Take good care and don't forget to subscribe, comment and press the bell icon. Bye-bye. Thank you.